Good morning and happy Sunday. I hope you're having a wonderful start to your morning. I'm super grateful to be alive today. I'm feeling great just finishing up here at the gym, getting that cardio in on the Stairmasters. And the message I have for you this morning is it's time to grow up. Now, this message is more for someone who's over 30. If you're still drinking weekly at the bar, club, partying, going to Tuesday, Thursday, $2 margarita nights, or just going out for a night of drinking on Wednesday because you've got nothing else better to do, it's time to knock this shit off and get to fucking work. You know, get on and put on your big boy pants and your big girl pants and start building a legacy and stop worrying about parting. You know, it's going to do nothing for you in the end. And, you know, it's funny that on social media I come across these things where I find more pictures of people with drinks in their hand at the bar, club, drinking, than I do a dumbbell in their hand, you know, lifting weights at the gym, exercising with a book in their hand, journaling, you know, talking about self-improvement, right? And, you know, we just have to get to this point where we realize time is of the essence. Um, now, especially if you have kids, um, we're not going to be here forever. And you need to know that when you're gone, that you've got something you can leave to pass on for your kids to set something, you know, up for them so that they're taken care of, you know, especially if our time comes shorter than we want it to. Um, you know, we all hope to live a long, healthy life, but the reality is we don't know when our time is up, and that's my focus right now. Maybe this is a reflection because, you know, I am getting older. I'll be 40 in a couple of years, and I spent a lot of years wasted doing the, the shit I shouldn't have been doing, um, being unproductive, and it got me nowhere but further behind in life, right? And so my only focus right now is building, you know, um, building upon my health and, and generational wealth uh, for myself and for my family. So if my time you know, comes up shorter than I want it to, I don't have a, a, a worry or fret in my mind to know that my family will be taken care of long after I'm gone. And that should be everyone's focus, right? And it's just prioritizing that first. It's not to say there isn't time to, to play. It's the work hard, play hard mentality. But what I'm saying is if you're at a certain age and you find yourself having more fun than actually putting in time to grow your future for you and your family, you've got to really rethink things, things here, right? And so if you need help with that, please reach out to me, you know, um, I'll tell you, it's been a full year since I've had a single drink, and I haven't even thought about it once. And again, it's not to say you can't have it. That's not the point. You know, when you're when you're doing it occasionally, when you're going out, you know, to celebrate, you know, or this and that, or responsible, that's one thing. But you know who I'm talking about. Some of you are doing this every freaking night of the week still, and, you know, you've got no money to spend, and any little money you have is going towards that, and you're not investing, you're not learning how to grow, then these are the people I'm talking about. So, again, message here is time to grow up. I I hope you have a wonderful Sunday and have a great rest of your day.